This is Ian Lamont, author of Google Drive and Docs in 30 minutes. Today I'm going to show you a really neat trick to quickly add a table to Google Docs using a new feature in Google Docs. If this video helps, please take a moment to follow and like it, and let's get going. This is Google Docs in Google Chrome. It doesn't matter if you're using a Mac or Windows or Chromebook or whatever. Just open up Google Docs, create a new document, and then go to Insert, Table, Table Templates. This is the new feature. There's a couple different options right here, but I found that I'm using the Review Tracker. And the great thing about it is it adds a kind of a header for the three columns. And then it even has these drop down menus here, which you can customize. So this is a really quick way to get started. And for instance, what I usually use them for is creating scripts. So here I might replace the header with audio and then video. Um, and I could say something like he, you know, Ian Lamont here, author of the book blah 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 okay and then here I could type image of the book cover okay and then I could change this to be something like um, you know voiceover only some other piece of information if you don't like a particular column such as if I want to get rid of this I can just right click over it and then select delete column and that will just leave two columns if you need to add a new row just go to the plus icon anywhere actually on any of the rows and we'll just add a new row so you can quickly expand that and then you can do other things too so if I wanted to let's say add a new column I could do that as well so this is a very flexible tool to get quickly uh, up and running with tables including some neat features and I advise you to check it out if this video helped you out please take a moment to like it and follow me and also you can check out the book that I wrote about Google Drive and Docs it's available at in30minutes.com. This is Ian Lamont, author of the book. Thank you so much for watching.